so I have more things cut out than I can fit in the screen at the moment. So I'm going to be moving stuff around and those kinds of things. If you have any questions about exactly what I'm using, I think I'm going to share the um, file for this. I cut everything at five inches. So it's five by five. So it's a little big for most cards. Um, you can use it in scrapbook layouts, but you could trim these down. Um, and make them smaller if you like, because these are great for scrapbook layouts, for home decor, and cards. You will be seeing all of these on all three of those from my side, even um, gift bags. You know what I'm saying? So cute. Okay, so, and I'm using all of our new beautiful colors, our close mark colors. Here they are in all their glory. This is one of them too. So these seven colors are new colors. Gorgeous, gorgeous. This is my favorite peacock. I love a good teal, and that is a beautiful teal. Okay, moving on. So we've got these really good borders. There are 50 of them. Um, the feathers. I mean, and there's all kinds of, this is just a small sampling of what there is. But there's this really pretty feather one. There's, again, kind of a Native American Southwestern themed background here. I've got it cut out in saffron. This is a beautiful Christmas cut. This would be great for cards. A very simple Christmas card. Cut this out. Put it on the front. Cut it out in glitter paper. Put it on the front, beautiful, done, bing, bang, boom. This is a Christmas wreath. Um, there's several wreaths, actually, and this is the Christmas version. I think there's a fall one and a spring one as well, and there might even be another one. I can't remember, but there's for sure three. This is a nice lacy um, background that's very versatile. This would be good for um, layouts, um, put different colors behind it, and which reminds me, you know, you can add layers to all of these. These come single layered, but you know, sky's the limit on what you could do. And then there's this really pretty, this is so trendy right now, the falling stars. Beautiful. I actually have a card um, made with this. Beautiful. Also, I cut out these, this is like a bubbles. This would be cute for like an aquarium layout. Or, you know, a fish card, you know, best fishes or whatever. I think that's really, really pretty. Um, this would also be good for um, stenciling, I think. Really, really cute. And then I had to cut this out. I didn't, this is, this has nothing to do with new colors or anything. But I thought this was so cute. It's like a slice of wood. How cute is that? I mean, so many things you could do with this. I really, really love this. This would be cute on a card layout. Home decor for sure. I mean... You could laminate these and make like little placemats for the kids for a themed party or for Thanksgiving or something. Anyway, so many things you can do. I love this function. Again, there's 50 different ones. So we're talking a lot, a lot of options. Anyways, guys, as always, you can check me out every day over at Courtney-Lane.com. It's my blog. And shoot me an email if you have any questions. I'd love to help answer. And again, you got to get this cartridge, folks. It is so good. Talk.